Mm. Ooh, that was like exceptionally good. So to sum it up, this boy hits me up whenever he wants to be intimate and I really want my back to get blown out. <laughs> okay. No. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gonna eat a little, drink a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no click base. What's up you guys? Hey guys, it's Steph and Tasha and we are back with another video. If you're new here, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the family. If you've been here before, welcome back. Baby, tell them what we're doing today. Today, you guys, we are doing a seafood boil mukbang. Yeah, that's Very, good. very light one, okay? Mm -hmm. You're not really that hungry? I just ate, okay. but it's okay. So, yeah, you, I just, you just being crack. gritty, right? Yes. Okay, it's all right. All right, you ready? Yes. Then let's get into the video. All right, guys, we're back. So, we this is a very light seafood boil. We have snow crab, blue crab, shrimp. corn, potatoes, shrimp, eggs. And, and boiled eggs, and one large potato that's not cooked. <laughs> yeah, that's just for looks. Yeah, that was just to help to prop this shit up, y'all. Oh, we got some rice under there, too. Oh, yeah, some white rice. Tasha wanted, oh, and the cucumbers. Oh, and the cucumber. I wanted to do yeah. the cucumber sausage and rice, but I'm doing this instead. Okay, so this was supposed to be a solo, y'all. That's why it's not that much food here. Tasha was like, I want a couple blue crab. So mm -hmm. I'll sit in with you. So I was like, okay. So wait, I asked them for a pound of blue crab. This is what I got. This. Not even. Uh, this I don't is what I got. It was a half a pound. It was, it was seven ounces. Yeah. <clears throat> and I paid for a pound. So guess what? We ain't getting none. All right. They will be refunding the, yeah. the whole blue crab amount. Yeah, don't play, time and play pretend pain. like you. Mm -mm, that's not even cool. All right, y'all. Here y'all go. I'm hungry. I'm looking forward to this. Mm. Ooh. Ooh, that was good. That was, like, exceptionally good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. So, Tasha just playing here, y'all, today. I am. I don't know how much eating she gonna do. I mean, I'm trying to eat a little bit of something, but these legs don't have any meat in them, so. Mm. I'm gonna have some snow. I might, I might give me a little snow. We're gonna do a viewer topic today. If you guys are new here, we generally eat for a little while, discuss the food, and we'll have a topic later. My baby hungry. Stuff. I really am. I haven't eaten anything all day. Mm. Y'all, I took Elijah to um, mm -mm -mm. the mall to get him some school shoes, and then we went to an escape room. Sad, I had to miss that. And he likes um, Panda Express, so I went to Panda Express and got a new Szechuan chicken. That stuff is good. Really good. I loved it. This is medium. <clears throat> I generally get the uh, mild. Mm -hmm. Oh, so it's kind of hot for you? Mm -hmm. I think I got corn juice all on my cheek, y'all. On my last solo, I had food all over my face the whole time, pretty much. <laughs> you mean the one where you had it on your forehead? Mm -hmm. That was hilarious. I was cracking up, y'all. <laughs> when I saw the edit, I died laughing. <clears throat> Who I was so into that lobster, loaded lobster. I didn't feel nothing. Mm. That's actually really good. Well, the cucumber is in the sauce. Not in the oh, sauce, the but yeah, to have the rice, the blue crab, and then the cucumber. Mm. Oh, I'm so hungry. Today's my mom's, birth mom's birthday, but this ain't coming out for a few days. But happy belated birthday, mom. Happy birthday, mom. About time it comes out. We're going to see her after this. Mm -hmm. After we eat. 
So we can't do too much. I found a little lemon cake, y'all. So I got that for her. She loves lemon. That's her favorite. She gonna love that. Let's see if you got some meat. Tasha is so attentive. That's really sweet. Woo! Y'all, it's hot in here. And the food is spicy. A spoon? I said food. Oh. This food is spicy. This is bomb. Mm. I love my sauce because today I put the stinging honey garlic. Thank you. I think we got it from K, right? Which one? Stinging honey garlic. K okay, from Cali. Like, what is this? A sauce or a seasoning? Mm. Like dry? Mm mm. Oh. Sauce? Red hot? Oh, okay. Threw that in there? Mm hmm. Let me try it. That's good. Sweet. Y'all want to taste? I do. Sure. Oh yeah. I like it, your alley. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. The sweet. Mm. Thank you. It enhances the flavor that you already have in your thing. Mm -hmm. You know, because it tastes like your uh, sauce, but just a tiny bit different. Like more robust. Mm. Cause I put my sauce in it, but put that in it too. Maybe you should make me a potato volcano. Okay. Mm. We gotta go live, babe. When? Soon. Cause we did not do our promise one Once day a week. week on the vlog channel yet. We don't have no onions though, so. This is all of your potato volcano. Oh, that's mine? Yeah. What's on it? Shrimp and a potato. Oh, okay. Sorry, that's all we had. We had soccer. You're right. But I wanted it for myself. Mmm. Mmm. Woo! Yeah, so if you guys are not subscribed to our vlog channel, the link is in the description below. We'll be going live on there. <clears throat> Sometime in the next few days. Hopefully you guys don't miss it. <laughs> sure, we might go tonight. Yeah, we might go Depending tonight. Depending on if we turn up with her dad a little bit. Yeah, we probably will. And then we come will. home, we'll we probably will. end up going live. Mm -hmm. And it's Friday. Yeah, we probably will. So people are going to be up late tonight. Mm-hmm. Woo! Y'all. Woo! I had a, um... I had a kind of a rough night last night. You did? Yeah, I wasn't, um... Feeling that great. Ladies' issues, if y'all know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. um, so I couldn't sleep, you know? Mm -hmm. And then I just ended up staying up so late and I was tired this morning. Yeah. That's the only reason why she didn't go with us to um, the escape room. Because it was supposed to be all three of us. It was supposed to be a family day. No, I'm so sad. That's okay. And then we're supposed to go to her mom's house afterwards. So Elijah got to get out of going to her mom's house because he probably didn't want to do that oh, anyway. No, <laughs> yep, he was. Look, oh, shucks. Mm hmm Can I steal some rice? Mm hmm As I just go ahead and steal it. What time we have there? Nine. Mm. Woo! Um I wanted to say something real quick before our topic topic. What? I wanna say that I was looking at the news today and I'm not gonna go too far into it, but I got so annoyed because y'all know what happened at Walmart, right? They found somebody today, an uh, off duty firefighter found a guy with body armor, fatigues mm -hmm. on, and a rifle with 100 um, rounds in it. What do y'all think he was going to do in Missouri? And they're talking about charging him with a misdemeanor. I don't feel like they should do that. So I'm sure he's 100 percent sure he wasn't black. No, <laughs> no, if he was black. He would have been killed. Wait, that was my point. I was being sarcastic. Oh, because you know the black guy that had the gun that he picked up that was in Walmart. Because Walmart sells, um, I think, air rifles. He had an air rifle. Mm -hmm. The police came in and killed him. Wow. Because somebody said he was wow. aiming it, uh, pointing it at people, but he wasn't. They came in and killed him immediately. It wasn't even real. I mean, it was an air rifle, but it wasn't one that you know. What in the world is an air rifle? 
Um, I'm not sure. But <clears throat> he picked it up from Walmart. It was in Walmart. Mm. He picked it up in Walmart. Wow. And was just, you know, he was going to purchase it. Sad you got to teach your brown sons that, uh, and I'm not saying this to hate on nobody. Y'all already know how we are. We don't care. We love everybody. But it's sad that you have to teach your brown sons that they can't even pick up an air rifle. But you don't. we don't have to teach our white sons anything. They can walk around with a wife, rifle, shoot people, and then <laughs> get treated like kings. They get Burger King. That's not fair. It's not fair. And I'm not saying that it's, um, it's anybody's. Uh, it is somebody's fault. But it's not always who we think it is. I know y'all didn't understand that, but I don't want to go too far into it, so I don't care. I don't want anybody to think that I'm thinking some kind of way, but y'all already know. Everybody knows. And I'm not just talking about black people, Mexican people. I'm talking about everybody. Everybody knows what's going on and what's happening. And you can pretend to not know, but you know. It's not your fault, but you know. I just don't like that. It's not fair. I'm ready to move out of the U.S. and find some place else to call home. Because you're not about to treat my son in any kind of way. When he has the same... Whatever. Let me go to the damn topic. Everybody needs to be treated the same, basically. If you're going to shoot one person with a rifle, shoot the next one too. Don't... Because you're afraid. That's your fault that you're afraid. Maybe you shouldn't be a cop. How do we change this, y'all? That's what I want to know. How do we change it? It hurts. We need to get some laws out here that's holding the police and the government accountable. No one holds for, them accountable for treating people unequally. He, but anyway, he, not to get too political before we get shut down. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Here's we ain't the topic. To get shut down, y'all. Here's the topic, you guys. We got a lot to say though. Send your children away because. I'm just going to read it verbatim. There we go. So kids, if you are watching this, I'm going to tell your mom that you watched it. So you better click off right now. Come to go to the next video. All right, here we go. <laughs> hey, Steph and Tasha, I'm a gay male and I need y'all advice. So ever since 2018, this down low boy has been hitting me up. So I'm like, maybe he thinks I'm a girl because people do mistake me for a girl. No, he knows I'm a boy. So to sum it up, this boy hits me up whenever he wants to be intimate. And I really want my back to get blown out. <laughs> okay. But, that's what he said. But this, <laughs> and, and, but this nigga has a newborn baby and is still with his child's mother. So when I found that out, I went off on him, texting him, talking shit. And the girlfriend has his password to his account. So she saw that I was messaging him. She texted me asking why I was messaging him. Um... And I told her the whole situation. So now basically she wants to pick me up and go over to his place and basically expose him in front of his family. So he obviously lives with his family. Do y'all think I should go with her to expose him or what? Woo. Woo. Y'all. Number one, ladies. Watch out. Guys, watch out too because there's some girls on the DL too. Oh, yeah. Everybody trying to That's be on the DL. Shoot. Just be honest. If Watch you out. like both, you like both. Ain't yeah. nothing wrong with liking both, but you got to be honest. Don't be greedy. That's not who. Exactly. People be greedy. Mm -hmm. I want both. No. You can, but you got to be real about exactly. it. Exactly. Be honest with people. There's a lot of people out there who are into polygamy. Yeah. Open relationships or whatever. Yeah. Find them. Okay. It's not cool to go behind somebody's back doing that. Man. Let somebody... Make the decision to, uh, you know, but to, you know, to deal with that. You know, what I think it is with guys, they're, they just, you know, some guys are just nasty. They just want to do what they do, you know, mm -hmm. and they can do that with a guy and they don't want anybody to know that they, you know. Yeah. But you can that's find a he, girl. That's who what he wants. Yeah. That's what he wants. Yeah, that's what he wants. You can't have everything you want, sweetie. Obviously you can, but you're going to get caught up. And that girl, mm-mm. I hope she left him. Mm -hmm. I hope she left him. Because that ain't cool. Mm -mm. So, should, should he expose him 
in front of his family or not? Is my question. advice. Is that, that's the question. My advice, no. Absolutely not. Because guys, men tend to get very violent. More violent than, than they ever have gotten in their lives when it comes to a gay man that exposes that's them true. or uh, the possibility of exposure. That's true. They, get, they tend People to... People have been more morbidly hurt. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Men, mostly. Okay. Um, you see a lot of men... Yeah. Mm -mm. I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't have nothing to do with that. I would leave him alone. I agree. I wouldn't do that shit either. Um, you don't need to expose him. You knew. Oh, you said that you didn't know he had a baby mama, I guess. Okay, well. Well, he did you wrong. Find somebody else. But no, don't expose him because you never know, too. His family, if he has brothers or whatever, they might do something to you, too. They might all be like, well, let's get this dude before he tells somebody else. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't do that. You don't understand what people will do to save their... To save face. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you did enough. I mean, he told the the girl, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. So you told his uh, white girlfriend or whatever, um, what it was. All you need to do is stop messing with him. Yep. That's all you need to do. Let them handle that. Yep. That's a dangerous situation. I wouldn't get in it. His family gonna have his back. You gotta think about that. Don't go up in his house. Yep. And then and they, they act like a lot of the time. When people come out, or especially if their family doesn't accept it, they will blame the person. Mm -hmm. You know, they'll blame the other person. So they, they're just going to be mad at you. Uh huh. You know, like you did this to him, you know. Mm hmm. <sighs> yeah, no. Don't do that. And possibly hurt I you. I agree with that. I know my mom blamed my girlfriend. Mm hmm. Told her you would molest her. Oh, okay. She was not happy. So, uh-uh. I would not do that at all. The girl just need to leave it on. She want, She basically wants to hurt him. She just mad, yeah. Yeah, she mad as hell, which I can understand. Mm-hmm. But I don't know why she would want to expose him, though. Oh, just because she's mad. Mm -hmm. She just want to revenge, she's basically. Like, I'm let everybody know your ass is gay or bi, whatever you are. I mean, they might he already know, though. though. He dumb as hell. Like, uh, she man. She probably told and they don't believe her. So she probably like, I want to prove it to them. That's not cool. Not to tell people how to cheat, but dumbass. Don't be having nobody texting your phone. You better get a Google number. Hey, don't don't tell them how to cheat. I'm just saying, like, you telling people how to cheat. stupid. Some people don't even know what a Google number is. Dumb as hell. I'll call you. Do not call me. Okay. I'm telling you, dumb as hell. You won't ever see. I'm not. I would never cheat, but usually. And then he, then he over here talking to the man in some kind of way, cause she saw something suspicious. They were so arguing. you over here texting. He was cussing him out, cause he found out he had a baby. I guess. So the gay guy was cussing him out, and she saw the text messages. Yeah. Why are you even having a? I don't know. Whatever. If you gay, be gay. Well, how are you gonna be gay? But the, the person don't know. Like the guy you messing with don't know. That that ain't gonna work, dummy. Huh? How are you gonna be sneaking around? But the person, the person you cheating with, don't know. That That's he, gonna that get you caught in, up. That he was in a relationship. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's a horrible mistake. Yeah. If you gonna cheat, at least let the person you cheating they with know, know you cheating. Place. Yeah. Know that you're a side bitch. Right. Or a side. Don't call me arguing about shit. Person, yeah. <laughs> we don't need to argue. Whatever I do is what I do. I can't get this, this y'all. What number we have? It's time to go. Are we at 27? Oh, yeah. Oh, 21. Yeah. Time to go. Time to run, y'all. Time to go, little poo poo. Even though Tasha, I could have sworn she wasn't hungry. I wasn't, but this just tastes so good <laughs> that I wanted to eat it. Y'all, we about to get out this video because I don't have a lot of time to edit, so I need to make this short. Oh, yeah. You gotta edit before we leave, huh? No, I'm gonna edit on the way here. Mm. So, if you like this video, give it a messy thumbs up. <laughs> Comment, let us know what you guys think. Please subscribe to our vlog channel. The link is in the description below. Make sure you set your post notifications to all so you don't miss any of our daily uploads, live streams, or premieres. Until next time, only good vibes. Peace.